Hello book people, good morning. Well, I'm off to Amsterdam for a day of book shopping. Uh, it's uh, been a while since I've been to Amsterdam, so yay, it's about time. And uh, I'm almost at the station, which is over there. And it's a two hour uh, train drive. So I live on the, the, the other end of uh, the Netherlands but uh, since uh, Holland is a very small tiny country uh, it takes only two hours to cross it and while I'm here I have a few minutes before the train uh, leaves I uh, can tell you uh, something uh, it's why I'm uh, Maybe you, you, you wonder why I'm not on screen uh, with my face in my uh, videos and uh, that's because before uh, people uh, start asking and I, well, I have to explain it every time which, which uh, I, I don't like that much. Uh, so I do it once. Uh, I uh, suffer from a disease uh, since uh, several years and uh, it uh, results in uh, uh, opera facial operations uh, now and then and since uh, the last few years there have been uh, seven operations in total and just uh, just reco recovered from uh, the latest one and uh, well just uh, I can only hope that it's uh, be the last one but with uh, this disease you never know if it uh, comes back or, or, or well uh, in any case uh, that's why it doesn't look uh, that awful, but uh, it, 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 it heals so well every time. But you know, camera is uh, very, uh, uh, what do you say, uh, merciless. You know, you see everything, especially when you're uh, uh, when you're close up uh, to the camera. And I just don't feel comfortable uh, with that. Uh, you know, uh, there are scars that are not healed uh, uh, fully, and uh, well. So that's why I uh, and I'll leave it at that because uh, uh, I re uh, actually I don't uh, really like to talk about uh, uh, my health, you know. So here we go off to Amsterdam through the door. Well, see you later. Kimpel Airport. That's the main airport of Amsterdam. as usual so here's the monument of the victims uh, of the second world war there's Madame Tussaud and there's the old palace and here we are at the uh, cock that's now inside and that's for the English department That was uh, nothing special, mm, way too much uh, choice and uh, but I am just around the corner and uh, at this English second uh, bookstore which is a really good one so I have much higher expectations of this one. It's, uh, I know also the, the, the favorite bookshop of uh, Britta Böhler and uh, well let's go in. The English bookshop and I find found some really good books well here is a little stair it's on a house that's for sale so I think nobody will be bothered by it oh well I, <laughs> well a bit too soon oh, okay let's see what we got all Pulitzer winners at the book exchange 
Here, Sol Bello, Humboldt's Gift, his new bestseller. Well, 1976, that is. Um, next one, uh, The Mambo King. Kings play Songs of Love by Oscar Higuelos. I've read a book from him, an earlier book one, The Sisters of. What was it? And I really loved it. Well, it. No, it's not here. But he's a, he's a really good author. Then I have found uh, this one. A Thousand Acres by Jane Smiley. House Made of Dawn by N. Scott Mamaday. Never heard of. But he or she won the Pulitzer. Uh, a Bell for Adano by John Hersey. Um, what's this? Oh, that's the, that's the second hand books shop. And the last one, not the least one, James Michener, Tales of the South. Never read any of the book. So, quite a good find, hey? And that, the whole stack, only for 25 euros. So, beautiful house. And it says here, The Shop of Hendrik Brandt, bookseller and Bible seller, since 17, bank for a loan of small money, small pennies. Look at the, the coins over there. Oh, I think it, they, they used to uh, lend money to uh, people in the early days. So now we're on to Waterstones and my favorite, the American Book Center, which has the biggest selection of English uh, and American uh, books in the whole of Europe. There it is. Very British. Good thing, all right. Also very touristy. It's a thing that uh, tourists love about Holland, flowers. So they have this whole street here lined up with seeds, uh, of course, uh, the wooden shoes, uh, flowers, more flowers, more seeds, and yeah, see here, real flowers, although the blue ones, are they real? Oh, come on, come on. Just can imagine they're real. No, they aren't. I'll stop because I don't think you want to see another 10 minutes of flower bulbs, etc. Although, I think Doris, uh, of all the D-books, likes this. Don't you, Doris? Uh -oh. uh, you flower girl. Oh, look at these. <laughs> also not real. <laughs> Funny man in a funny boat. It's so Amsterdam. And back home again. Bye bye Amsterdam. <laughs>